Let us pray together. What a privilege it is to come into your presence, Lord, to experience the power of your spirit right here in the room where we are. And that spirit which fills us here in this room is the very same spirit which is filling the hearts of each who are watching this service today in whatever room they may be in. In these days, when loneliness and separation, when division has caused us to feel as if we are we are facing the world all by ourselves. Your spirit flows here and we feel the power of being united. Not united because we're all alike. How very boring would that be? But united by your love. It is that love which is getting us through these times. And for that, we are so grateful. It is that love which will carry us in the days ahead until that day comes when all the barriers of life, when even time and space itself cannot keep us apart, we shall all be one in the glory of your kingdom. That day when as we've just heard so beautifully sung, we shall all fly to you. We ask your sustaining and your life-giving love would be felt so profoundly today by those who are suffering the most right now and by those who are serving the suffering. Grant to all of us the gift of your patience, that we would continue to do that which we know we need to do until that day comes when we can resume the fullness of our shared fellowship. In all, in, in all of this, we pray to you, Lord Jesus. Amen. <laughs>